Mumbai, one of the largest cities in the world. 20 million people live in the greater metropolitan area. Traffic, congestion, pollution. The core challenges of a mega city. To be confronted and explored. The BMW Guggenheim Lab connects and supports innovative people and ideas. A key issue in Mumbai, the challenges of traffic and transport. The Kala Nagar traffic junction. 19,000 vehicles and 60,000 passengers pass through during peak hours. Architect and Mumbai Lab team member Tripti Amritvar Vaitla led a competition to find improvements for this congested traffic hub. Students and professionals from different backgrounds designed innovative proposals and concepts. If we could segregate buses and uh, cars, uh, we can definitely improve the passenger throughput on this uh, uh, road. Also, we need to look at traffic calming measures like uh, proper pedestrian crossings, if we can use the skywalk uh, with more uh, uh, proper escalators or lifts, more people will be able to use it. We also look at uh, this traffic junction not only as to improve uh, mobility, but also a place where we can improve accessibility and look, look at this place as a destination. Neville Mars, also an architect and member of the Mumbai lab team, developed another vision for the local transport system a 75 kilometer long connection between the train stations and the places where people live. The land link is um, a pedestrian bridge that reuses old water pipelines in the city to provide um, a pedestrian deck on top of public space. But actually it starts off as um, an auto rickshaw highway. The space in between the two pipelines becomes uh, a highway for the little uh, tricycles, tuk-tuks they have here in uh, Mumbai. By actually providing micro-scale transportation solutions, and we developed quite a few, the public transportation network will be alleviated, will be much more comfortable, and you can actually enjoy driving through this amazing city. The city is amazing, but also challenging. More than half of the city's residents live in slums with little privacy and space for their own. And public space for recreation is very limited. As part of a study realized during the lab, demographer and lab team member Aisha Dasgupta became involved in learning how and where people in Mumbai find privacy. Some people were reporting that they um, found time to themselves um, or found time to be with, together with their partners or their, their friends actually in public spaces, in a park or on the beach. Some were even saying public transport. So it was interesting how some Mumbai cars were responding perhaps non-traditional um, ways of finding that time to themselves. The BMW Guggenheim Lab a mobile think tank where people and ideas of all kinds come together. In Mumbai, nearly 24,000 visitors of all ages participated in workshops, discussions, projects and tours. It might appear to be a kind of unusual direction for a museum, but we, that's conscious on our part. We determined internally that it was good if the museum went to the streets and the street should not only be Fifth Avenue in New York City, but streets around the world. Internally, we've learned something together, quite a lot, and externally, even more. The Mumbai lab has closed, but the bamboo structure remains in the city. So will the ideas of the lab. Some of the projects may be realized in the future. Join us for an exhibition highlighting themes from the lab's first three cities, New York, Berlin, and Mumbai, at the Guggenheim Museum in New York in fall 2013.